Okay, now we are going to continue with your workbooks. Please open your workbooks to page number. Um, this is number 33. Page 33. We are not doing the page number 34 this, because this is your homework. Don't forget to do your homework. This homework and the online homework. Don't forget to do the unit four and unit five. Unit six, you can present the other week, next week. So let's start doing this. Part nine, present continuous for future arrangement. Remember when you use the present continuous for the future, you have to write a complement saying the time. For example, um, if I say, I am eating a, a sandwich. If I stay in this part, I'm saying that I'm eating the sandwich uh, at the moment, not in the future. If I say I'm eating a sandwich um, tonight, so it means future. Voy a comer un sandwich esta noche. So present continuous for future arrangements. So you are going to put the verbs into the present continuous. All the verbs in present continuous. Okay, everything. Now, in part number 10, we are going to use will, going to, or the present continuous. So remember, for future, we use will for uh, decisions that we take at the moment. For plans, okay, going to. Present continuous, I have to say the time or the day that indicates the future. So you're going to complete the conversation choosing letter A or letter B. Okay, you choose letter A or B. And here, confusing vowel sounds, the pronunciation. Well, I already explained this, but we are going to do it again. This word, the pronunciation is want, want. And this other, the pronunciation is won't, won't. This is the contraction of will not. So they are not the same, the pronun they don't have the same pronunciation. They are not the same. So we, we don't say, I won't go. I won't go. This other, this is 